Okay, the next step is to make our sickle cell hemoglobin, and it's gonna look different. It's gonna look like this compared to the regular, okay? So you're going to cut out four of these squares, okay? Then you're going to find valine. There's a little triangle that says valine, and that's the amino acid that's different in uh, sickle cell hemoglobin. You're gonna put your valine toward the top right, then you're going to flip it over so that it's upside down and valine is uh, over here, okay? Then you're going to fold it in half from left to right or right to left. Open it back up again and fold to the middle. Okay, and there's some guide, dotted guidelines that will tell you kind of if you're doing it right. Like a, like a book or, or doors, okay? Then you're going to, see valine's here now, you're going to open it up and fold, with this side folded down, you're gonna fold a triangle to that line that here. Okay, and then open it back up. You're not gonna use that right now. Okay, F turn it. Do the same exact thing. The left fold flap goes down and make a triangle three-fourths that folds three-fourths over. Then you're gonna fold this over. Okay, fold that flap on top of the triangle so it looks like this now. Okay. Then turn it over. It should look like kind of a house with a chimney. All right, now, this flap that you folded earlier is going to go underneath here. So, it made it easier that you already folded it. Trust me, if you do it, if you do it without folding it, it's gonna be harder. Um, and now you're at this stage. Now you just fold these triangles onto the side onto the back side, and you notice that valine's sticking out here. Then there's a dotted line here and a dotted line here. You're gonna fold along those lines, and this will look like, temporarily, look like a little square. Okay? And look, our valine is right here, right? And our hydrophobic valine does not want to be near um, the watery environment of the cell, so it fits into a little pocket in a neighboring, um, in a neighboring hemoglobin, sickle cell hemoglobin. So you find the thing that's called pocket, and you stick it in. Okay, you you've made four when you're done with it, but you can even to form a hemoglobin fiber, which is what causes the cell to turn into a half moon shape. You can, you can actually add these on to other students and make one giant um, stick of sickle cell hemoglobin, okay?